What's going on everybody? J Canada back with some Madden Connected Franchise mode. And I've seen some comments saying, hey, you should switch teams. I think people want to see something different. So I'm just going to speed up this season. And that's starting by simulating. As you see, I simulated against the Ravens. And we took a 23 to nothing win. I figure if I simulate every second game or everyone that's not important, uh, we can fly through. So basically, there's a total of four games in this video. Two simulated, two playing. I will show the highlights. And I will show my stats quickly. Uh, four reception, 47 yards. Sorry about that. And the first game action we will see is against the, I can't remember, Arizona Cardinals, right? I played this game because it's a division matchup, but they're actually not a very good team on paper. So looking to build on back-to-back -back wins, I think, now. I can't remember what happened last video, but I apologize. We've been without a bit video for a while, uh, Madden 1 especially, and that's just because... It's the last week of classes uh, for me this week at university. Next week is exams, so it's really crunch time. But man, I'm excited for Christmas break. I can stay home, make lots of videos, uh, expect big things there. And I'm trying to expect big things from Russell Wilson, but you guys are saying leave the Seahawks. Russell Wilson's throwing the season away. That time he put the ball on the ground via the fumble. Cardinals went up early 3-0. Uh, three nothing rather but here i'm back on the kickoff return i'm working on it and i get to the outside and i bust it down you're gonna see quite a few good returns punt and kick in this video because i am working at it and here i'm one-on-one -on -one. again i'm not sure if that's patrick peterson or cromarty i don't think so though because look at how easily i just burned them uh you're also gonna see a lot of touchdowns this video just saying but i burned them easily I did that thing where I kind of just loop around after the catch and, and split the safety and the cornerback. But if you pay attention to when I bring up the play art, you'll be able to see that my matchup advantage is huge almost every time I am running a route out there. So trying to take advantage of it. Uh, we'll see if we can see it there. Yeah, completely green. And what's going to happen? I'm going deep again. This time, when it makes you do that little jump animation, like you kind of have to like jump and then it pushes you up it, it's the weirdest thing i don't know how to explain it but you can't uh, run with the ball after so i didn't get the td there next play though i'm going deep and russell's throwing it and we couldn't connect we couldn't connect that was almost picked off maybe if that was peterson back there he would have picked it off although that was a safety but in any event the very next play they send me deep again i'm one-on-one -on -one, and look at this where's the safety nowhere to be found another touchdown in the first half so at this point, I realize this isn't the same Arizona team we've seen, and it isn't the same Arizona team that real-life NFL teams are facing. Uh, they're playing very well, even now without Carson Palmer, although they took the L to the real-life Seahawks. Uh, that was a good game. 19-3, to not the greatest score, but the Seahawks' defense looks like it's coming back around. It'll be interesting to see tomorrow night. American Thanksgiving, of course, I'm Canadian, so American Thanksgiving, the Seahawks and the 49ers are playing, and here's almost a big return if I would have broken that off. But it's the first time they play this year. Both teams, to my best of my knowledge, are both healthy. Uh, Alden Smith's back from his suspension, right, for the 49ers. Uh, in any event, though, that'll be a good matchup. I don't know. I, it's hard to p uh, predict what's going to happen. Uh, both teams are a lot better than their records indicate, I believe, as Russell Wilson, a huge run, and he fumbles again. But you got guys on both sides that can alter the tide of any game. So I'm excited for that. I'm not even going to get to watch it. Well, I'm going to miss the first half at least because I'm in class. Like, are you serious? The one evening class I have falls on Thursday night. So that Thursday night matchup eh, usually doesn't get watched by me. But, you know, I'll be all over it. Uh, the highlights and maybe I'll even PVR it. But anyways, back to the game at hand. You can see we're up 21 to 3 now. I'm running in the end zone and it's picked off. Again, I can't see that name. Maybe it'll pop up here. I think it's a guy named Washington. Oh, no, Jay Arenas. So I really don't know that. Gilbert Arenas, did he make the switch? <laughs> Just kidding, but uh, still 21-3. to They couldn't do anything with the ball, and I am getting the ball on this punt return, and look at this action. Must have got 25, 30 yards there. Maybe I'm overshooting. Who knows? But I think it's really our defense, and again, I'm talking about video game Seahawks. Our defense that is stepping up because teams are getting the ball, you know, down at the 20 or something, and they're three and outing left and right, but in any event, we go up 28-3. to That was Doug Baldwin on the reception. Here, I'm working one-on-one -on -one again. I got the step. And goodbye, I'm deep, and I'm gone, and I am high-stepping and flipping in the end zone. I love that, where you do the little barrel roll in the air. But what is that, my third touchdown of this game? Something like that. It's either second or third. Uh, that was <laughs> with a minute left. I just noticed that now, but it's what all great players do, right? You got to pad your stats a little bit. 
I'm really bad for that. When I'm playing these games and I'm not uh, live comming especially, I just want to have fun and rack up the numbers. But at the end of the day, we went 35-3. Russell goes 20 for 29, 292 passing yards, four touchdowns, and just one interception. So did I catch? No, I caught three then. Um, I should have cut down the stats viewing a bit. But Ryan Mallett, wow, he is a very big man. I don't know much about Ryan Mallett, obviously, but he's a big dude. We only gave Marsh on nine rushing attempts. I actually had three rushing attempts for eight yards. I didn't include those just because it was in that garbage time. I always try the jet sweep, but seven for 194, 27.7 average yards, three TDs, no drops. That's pretty unremarkable. Or wait, pretty remarkable. No, no, it is unremarkable. I don't know what I'm saying, but next simulated game, we took the W against the Rams. I missed what the score actually was there, but... Hopefully you guys saw, and I put up 10 receptions for 84 yards, so only 8.4 yards per carry. That's unlike Jay Canada. You guys know it, so I figured, you know what? I got to get that average back up. And here we are at, uh, isn't this called Paul or James Brown or Paul James something field? Am I, am I just thinking of something completely wrong? I don't know. That might be Tampa Bay's field. Anyways, I don't play in Cincinnati a whole lot, and look at this. I'm taking that one all the way to the outside. Could have beat that one guy. Maybe it would have been gone, but another good return. I wasn't lying. I wasn't lying about that. Uh, here we go, though, on first down. This was actually the very next, but this is the first play from scrimmage. Yeah, that's right. And Russell Wilson throws a pick six, but how about that interview Richard Sherman, speaking of the Seahawks, did with uh, cutout Doug Baldwin yesterday or the day before, whenever that was. What do you guys think about that? That uh, satirical humor he brought. I found it entertaining. Um, I'm hearing some things like people are saying, you know what, Russell or uh, Richard, you you got to learn to smarten up because some of those facts weren't even right. Like there's something in the CBA as I catch a touchdown, something in the CBA about players do make some kind of money for doing media uh, spots. But I thought the beer advertisement uh, little play was funny and I, I don't know. I just enjoyed it. But that's because I like Richard Sherman, people who don't. Uh, there's a lot of people that are giving him respect though around the league. So Take from it what you will. I thought it was funny, and I don't think it's a distraction. That's just Richard being Richard. Has another nice punt return there. There was also one other thing I wanted to talk about. Probably had to do with the NFL, but I can't seem to remember. <laughs> no, 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 I can't seem to remember, but... Oh, well, we're up 14-7 here in the first. Uh, did I catch both touchdowns? Did I? Oh, I already can't remember. I don't know, but there's a rushing touchdown for Russell Wilson. So Russ finally does something right. What do I have two already? Uh, I don't know. I can't keep track of all these TDs I'm scoring because I'm such a beast. Just kidding though. But I don't know if you guys caught that. My overall is up to a uh, 86. So still make mistakes. So I dropped that pass. I gotta get that catch in traffic. But overall 86. I'm six five something like that. So I, I don't know. I think this is the right way to build a wide receiver if you guys want to have success. And right over the middle and a spin move. Oh baby. I think I put some points into my spin move because it's working in these couple of games I'm showing. I like the underneath routes like that when it's man-to-man because -man nobody can keep up with me and then it's an easy first down. But, I mean, what was that? Only like 12 yards? That's like nothing for this game. And look at this. Nobody is covering me. All of a sudden, they realize and try and send a guy, but it's too late. I catch the ball. There it is. There's another 20-yard reception. Like in this video, I, I think I've had a couple receptions that are like, you know, 10 yards or less. Yeah, Maybe when we get in the red zone. But other than that, I'm a deep threat to the max, and here I am taking the step, and the safety, I don't know what he was doing, trying to undercut that rope, but uh-uh, not Jay Canada's house. Look at their coach, he's looking on, are you kidding me, where's, uh, where is, um, 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 why can't I think of the coach of the Bengals name, he's been there forever, Marvin Lewis, yeah, where's Marvin Lewis, he would be upset, maybe he finally got canned, and the Bengals are a pretty solid team, but he's been there for so long, so many losing seasons. But anyways, here I go again over the middle. This time I wasn't able to cut through the safety in the cornerback. I did get hauled down, but another, you know, 20 plus yard reception. You could see a sneak preview of my stats there if you wanted, but I ain't done. This is only the third quarter. Again, we're in a blowout, but here I catch the ball on the out route and I thought I was going to get hauled down there, but those ratings, man, those ratings are going up and I sneak into the end zone and do a little bit of a dance, a little jump dance, and we're up 37 to seven. So I probably could have cut both these games off at about the third quarter because we were absolutely destroying so i will probably skip a few of my receptions but here it is 38 to 7 uh yeah we're all the way down to the two minute mark almost of the fourth quarter and again gotta pad the stats a little bit there's a catch over the middle you know it's helping russell wilson too as long as i don't make him throw interceptions he's getting extra yards so here i am thought i'd just get a nice little uh hitch route right here but look at this 
nobody picks up Jay Canada, the white guy. You know, number 10, leading the league in everything. And I go deep. And I high step. And I flip into the end zone. And this is my favorite part. Watch this. Yeah, I'll just take a nap. I'll just point to heaven. <laughs> 240 yards, four uh, touchdowns. That's pretty unreal. I think I'm talking over the commentary, but Jim and Phil were just in awe of how I was closing in on the record for touchdown receptions, which I think is five, if I'm not mistaken. But here it is. Are you gonna, guys going to cover me sometime soon? But that, that was all we had for running up the score. We actually, no, that's a lie. We actually ended up running it up, ended running, ended by running it up to 55 to seven. So four huge wins for the Seattle Seahawks. We're making the playoffs this year's boys. This year, boys, there's there's no denying it. No, there isn't. Five touchdowns for Russell, two interceptions, but who cares? 403 yards. Marshawn, sorry, buddy, you don't get much burn in this uh, in this offense. But Jay Canada, 10 receptions, 240 yards, four TDs. That's unreal. You guys are unreal for the support. We're almost at 400 subscribers. It'll be a great Christmas present if you guys keep supporting me. And hey, I'll try and return it by putting out lots of videos once we get through this treacherous exam phase and end of semester phase. But you guys know what to do. Like, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment if you'd like. And as always, boys, have a good one. Peace.